How goes it everybody? My name is Howitzer and welcome back to SnowRunner. Today I got another mod to show you. The GWC Atlas. Glitchworks brings us this one of course, and according to the description, it's his take on what the Dairy Longhorn should have been. Now he says this thing's pretty tough, so let's see what we can do to this thing. Alright, for engines, looks like we have a 12.1 liter diesel, a 15.2 liter diesel, and then a 19 liter diesel. Uh, so we're gonna do that. Get as much power as we can. Gearbox, you got 10 speed default, 10 speed highway, and an 8 speed heavy off road. All right, let's do that one first, and we'll probably switch it later. Suspension, we got normal height, lifted, and then active heavy hauling. So we'll do lifted for now. I'm pretty sure I'll change the suspension when we eventually pull a trailer with it. Tires, oh, actually, just a little selection of tires. And he's got some stats, which is very nice to, to have. All right, so I think we're gonna go with these 55 inch military mud tires. This tire has the best uh, off-road traction and stuff like that. So we'll do that. Winch, we got stock, stage two, stage three, and stage four. Definitely stage four. Frame add-ons. Well, you got a two slot bed. You got the log carrier, log crane, and flatbed. Most of your normal ones, fuel tank. Got this really big fuel tank. Repair module, huh? That's pretty cool. Turn it into a recovery truck if you wanted. That's kind of sweet. Saddle high, saddle low, you know. With the Tatra fuel tank and all that stuff. Frame mounted winch. Heavy wrecker, huh? That looks interesting. But for right now, let's just do the, the two slot bed. It doesn't look too bad on there. All right, for visuals, we got the front bumper. We got the weighted winch bumper and then just a regular stock bumper. Let's do the weighted winch, sure. Spare tire, yeah, right on the side right there. Yeah, I'll leave that alone, I don't need that. You can put a beacon up there if you want. I don't know why it goes to the back of the truck for this. Snorkel, yep. Colors, it's like they're all custom colors. Let's go for like this really dark camel. That doesn't look too bad, sure. And of course you got bobbleheads and other accessories you can do with it too. Well, let's go see how this thing does. I'm kind of curious. Hopefully it's really good. This is not a small truck. <laughs> this is a big truck. A little interior shot here. That definitely looks like a military truck on the inside, huh? Definitely a diesel, too. Let's go! Diff lock's on all the time. That's kind of nice to see. And, of course, it'll pull... The big boy trailers, too. Oh. I guess the G-Dub the G-Dub trailer doesn't want to render in right now. <laughs> we'll do that later, though. I want to see how this thing does by itself first. Doesn't really seem to be overly fast, I guess. Put it in a full drive right away. Take her down to the mud pit here. Not, not a care in the world. Right through that. Let's see what high gear. Oh, no. High gear isn't all that special. Not with this transmission anyway. Let's see what Schwampy Town has to offer. I mean, right off the bat, this thing's doing amazing. Oh, am I gonna drop gear? I'm still holding eighth gear. Oh, it's refusing to give up. Yeah, this thing's not doing too bad. It's not really all that high off the ground. Well, you got a lot of axles and stuff in the way. You know, the bumper's pretty low to the ground. So far, this thing's doing pretty damn good. Another heavy-duty truck I would probably use as a scout. <laughs> yeah, this thing made quick work of this area, for sure. Not a care in the world. He says it's up there with Goliath, and Goliath was a damn good mod. 
Oh, we'll try the river now. It held eighth gear through that whole area. It did not drop gear once. That's pretty impressive. Let's go do some shit that I wasn't made to do. <laughs> Whee! We'll take her down this way. See how it does on the rocks once. Oh boy. Yeah, this is oh, oh not what this truck is made for at all. Oh, that bumper is gonna fuck me, ain't it? Oh, come on. Come on, just grab a hold of one of those rocks. Yeah, the... Oh, no! Oh. Yeah, the approach angle on this truck is terrible. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm good. I think. Yeah, I am. <laughs> Let me, let me line the truck back up here. Alright, we're back to this position here. Let's see if we can actually get up there this time. Let's see if we can just catch one of those tires. Let's see if it'll walk it. Oh, it's so close. I mean, I'm so close to grabbing that rock with that tire. <laughs> Son of a bitch. This, that winch is really long. Oh, yeah, there we go. Come on. There you go. Come on. No, 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 no. Oh, please. Keep going. Don't slide off the rock. You are so fucking close. Oh, oh my God, you are so fucking close. See what a little winching it does here. Come on, pull me up. There we go. Oh! Come on. Come on. Come on. Here you go. Yeah! <laughs> like I always say, when in doubt, winch it out. Little winching never hurt nobody. Take it up this way once. This is a big fucking truck. Let me turn this fucking thing around here. All right, let's see if it'll go back up here. Uh, I, I don't think I can even get it to walk up it. That bumper is just, it's in the way. <laughs> I think I'd have better luck with the uh, stock bumper because it's, the stock bumper sucks up to the truck just a little more. I guess I'm going to have to move over. Let's see if I can get it to go up over here once. There we go. Oh, come on. Oh, there you go. Yeah. All right. So, I mean, it's... Yeah, that bumper's pretty low, but it's okay. Let's uh, put that highway transmission in once. See if we can get a little speed out of it. All right, here's the 10 speed. Oh, 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 yeah, it'll, okay, maybe it is a little fast. I was not expecting that. Let's see if we can actually make it down the hill. Oh boy. Yeah, this thing. Oh. High gear is fast. I can't even control the truck. Oh, I think the bumper hit. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. I think I'm I think I'm good. Well, I mean, it didn't do too bad. 
This is a big truck to be doing that with. Oh yeah, this... Oh yeah, high gear is fast. Oh, that steering is so slow. Oh boy. Oh, I just broke the suspension in my gas tank. I don't have any repair parts. Oh shit. Yeah, high gear and the highway transmission is fucking fast for this thing. Oh my god! All right, let's uh, let's go pull a trailer now. <laughs> All right, let's grab the trailer here. And I did put the heavy hauling suspension on too. So we'll put the old ramps down. Let's go grab a truck. Again, we're gonna be using the A and K because I don't know. I, I like the A and K. I don't, I don't know if you want to see me use another truck. Put it down below. All right, we'll pack it now. Put the ramps up. And let's go head on on our way. I went back to the eight-speed off-road transmission. Let's see how this suspension does. The truck is very capable, so we're gonna see how it is pulling a trailer. I bet it's gonna do just as good. It seems like a pretty decent truck. We'll put it in high, just for now. We'll see if it pulls the hill. It should. It seems like it makes plenty of power. Oh, yeah. Not even a fucking issue at all. God, that steering is so slow. I gotta be careful with that. The front end doesn't seem too light. It is a little light, even with the bumper on there. But I think it'll be all right. Yeah, so far, I mean, this thing's doing amazing pulling this truck. Let's see if we nose dive. Oh my god, I almost lost the fucking truck. Fuck, I did that in the last video. Almost that same exact spot. Didn't really give it a chance to nose dive because I had to slow down, but that's okay. Bottomed out the trailer just a little bit. This thing's a beast, huh? I don't mind it. This thing's not that bad. Yeah, I bet the Dairy Longhorn wishes it was fucking this good. They're all right in the game, but they're not this good. Let's uh, let's see if it'll pull the hill. I think the tires are good enough. Oh, yeah. Keep going. Keep going. Don't stop. There you go. Come on. All right. Yeah, hell, it actually did that really easy. Not too bad. All right, we'll go back down now. Oh, boy. Slow down. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Yeah, smooth as silk. <laughs> yeah, I would say this is a pretty decent truck. Yeah, you'll probably get some people bitching about it being too OP or whatever, but it's not too bad. All right, I guess now we're just going to see if it'll drop out of eighth gear through here. It's usually once you get to the, where the, the dirt meets the asphalt, Usually it'll drop. And it didn't. Oh, this thing makes a lot of fucking power then. Yeah, I would say this truck is pretty damn good. It still hasn't dropped out of 8th gear. We'll see if the little puddle does it. Nope. Just 
keeps on chugging along. Not a care in the world. Wow, that's amazing. That's really cool. This thing did really, really good. This is a nice fucking truck. I mean, I've seen all I need to see with this one. Well, that was the GWC Atlas. Yeah, I would say this thing did absolutely amazing. This is one hell of a truck, man. This thing makes a lot of goddamn power. I guess another truck that would probably pull anything that you put behind it. And the tires are amazing, too. The tires are really, really good in the mud. Like, really good. With eight-wheel drive, I mean, I would hope this thing would go just about anywhere. And it does. Good job with this one. I liked it a lot. I had a lot of fun. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. Hit that subscribe button for me as well. And I will hopefully see you in the next one.